just catching some rays up here? Oh, you know, trying to be a model and stuff. <laughs> Hello, good morning. What up? Welcome in to the Bingham House here in freezing frozen tundra of Utah. We are getting ready this morning. Got kids out of bed. In fact, I didn't have to do much. Rexy Doodle was up and dressed before I even came down the hall. Way to go, bro. I'll get your hair done. Don't worry. We got this. Okay. We got this. Hazy girl. Hang on. Can you show me what you do with your hair this morning when you woke up? We sent a picture to mom as a joke and said, am I doing this right? Wait, get the ball, get the ball. <laughs> we do? Okay. So mom, I gotta tell you guys, you know how she is. You know how prepared she is. I don't know if it's a lack of confidence in me, if it's a concern for her sweet daughter's well-being and appearance, or if it's just being overly kind and nice. But mom had everything ready for Hazy this morning. She had the clothes laid out, this bow laid out, and so we know exactly how to do it, right? Hazy girl, we've been working on your hair, and there we go. Okay, ready for school. <laughs> we yeah. sent a picture of that. Send that picture to Mindy. And and said, it was like more than middle, yeah. Sent that picture to mom this morning and said, hey, am I doing this right? On a fun start to the day, you guys. It is just barely 7 a.m. Clock just struck 7 a.m. The kids have already been up and dressed and ready. Crew's already dressed. These guys are up, getting a quick and easy breakfast as they head out the door for school today. I had to say, mom has Hazy's clothes laid out for today, Bo included, her outfit for tomorrow, and then her church clothes for Sunday all hung in a row on her closet handle. So we are set and prepared, you guys. Mom leaves no room for error here. Speaking of mom, oh my goodness, you guys. Now that I have seen the footage and I have seen the vlog, Stuff that mom shot yesterday. First of all, did those ladies knock it out of the park or what with that vlog content? That was so much fun. I loved being along for the ride, experiencing every minute of their adventure through the video. Hit the like button to tell them what an incredible job they did on the vlog. I just smiled ear to ear the entire time editing that thing. So if you haven't seen it yet, go back and watch yesterday's vlog where they got on their flight and headed out to Miami. They've arrived, they are ready to rock, and today is a new day. Today is going to be the day that they're on the beach. They're taking their pictures. She's got the swimming suits they're gonna be breaking out, and I hope it is just a full-blown fun and memory filled the day of just taking pictures hopefully eating some fun food seeing the sights and exploring that southern Florida area we will check in with them today quite a bit to see what they're up to because they can clearly crush it when it comes to vlogging their travel adventures here at home we got crew now we're going to get these kids hair combed get some breakfast get their backpacks coats get them loaded into the car and off to school for another day last day it's a Friday before the weekend we got a lot of fun stuff coming up including a check-in on the house to see how that's going today they're gonna be out again framing the home as well as whatever Whatever else we get up to today, stick around. Now let's go see how mom's starting her day out there in Florida. Oh, I think it's gonna work, Hazy. What do you think? Good job. Yeah. Hey. Okay, good. Hello and good morning everyone. Welcome back. I, myself, here with Michelle and Jolene. I am in Miami. Brandon is home taking care of the kids. He texted me this morning that he got the kids off to school. They had a great morning. He teased me by putting a bow in the middle of Hazy's head saying, I think we've done this right. Oh boy. He got it right. He was just tricking me. They're having fun at home. Brandon's able to get some stuff done today while the kids are at school. I am here on a work trip. That's what we're gonna call it. You guys can see right out here is the ocean and it's so pretty. We are in this beautiful high rise, like literally 44 flights up in the middle of the sky, it feels like. It is so gorgeous here we woke up. There was so much like fog and clouds down low that we couldn't see out of our windows until a little bit later in the morning. Burned off and now it is just absolutely beautiful. Today, the whole reason I'm here in Miami and in Florida and brought Michelle and Jolene to help is because we are after some swimming suit shots that I'm trying to get. That is really hard to do in Utah with the dead, dreary winter. We came to the one and only beautiful Miami. We've got beautiful landscapes everywhere. We were going to try and head down to this incredible pool. We're having a little bit of a problem because last night, right as we checked in, one of the towers, there's three of them, one of the towers, power went out. Appeared to be a little surge. This has not been actually confirmed. We've heard there was a small, small fire. 10 or 12 fire trucks showed up. I have a little bit of footage from last night I can show you guys right here. Seems like no big deal. Now today, there are certain amenities that are not working. One of them being the pool. The other one that we tried to use was the gym. So that's a little unfortunate. We're going to make do. We're gonna head to the beach instead and get some amazing shots there. We're just all getting ready. I just curled my hair, put on my swimming suit and my swim cover up, and we're gonna head out, go have some fun, and enjoy this amazing day in Miami. 
I showed you little sneak peeks yesterday of this amazing place we're staying at. It is gorgeous. This is just an entire glass wall. And over here is this amazing balcony. <laughs> and it includes a beauty salon. I actually walked into the window. <laughs> <laughs> I was texting Brandon, I was on my phone, and there was a mark where my face eventually hit the window. I ran into the window, and it's gorgeous out there. I stayed out there this morning. But over here, we have beauty salon going down. Getting all ready. Yeah, we're getting ready for the beach. And I'm in the getting back seat. Let me see if it's gonna look done. like this. Oh yeah, Michelle, I think you maybe missed a piece. <laughs> Good care of her mom. Big trends coming at you. So we have to tell you, we are dressed. Oh, so we were wearing sweaters inside because Michelle keeps the temperature at what sixty. Michelle, that is not what I do. That is. And what so I've got a coat on, and they were like, "You guys, it's kind of warm out there." I was like, "No, I think I need a coat." We're going to the bank. <laughs> It feels like it from the temperature of this condo. It feels uh, like we definitely need a cut. So sound last night. We really did. The views from this place are absolutely amazing. So gorgeous. This is my bedroom. It's so much better to show you in the daytime. This bed was actually really great. We call it the taco because if you sit right in the middle, it kind of folds up. It was fantastic. It's nice to have the entire bed to myself. Sorry, Brendan. I really do miss you. I love you. Here's the views out of my bedroom, and I have a sliding window that you get to see all of this. It's amazing. Enough of inside the house, what we're doing inside. What we really came for is to be outside on the beach, at the pool, and enjoy all the beauties here of Miami. So we're gonna head out right now. We have finally, after a few hours, what feels like made it to the, the beach. beach. Woohoo! Joey. Had a few hiccups along the hey, way. And this is our stick right. Sorry. Hey, yeah, ahead. that's our car, guys. We just whoa, there <laughs> is a pole. We just walked in an entire circle around a block looking for a market because well, we're doing swimming suit pictures and I have really dry legs. I needed yeah. lotion. That's one of the reasons. I mean, when she could write her name in her legs, it was like, okay. Well, I know. You might need some lotion. I have the driest skin. <laughs> We've got all the bags, bought this cute little bag and this beautiful jewelry at the store. Just to make the pics a little extra. Jolene might be carrying a coconut we found on the ground. You know, it was green. What's inside of it. <laughs> it's green. Oh. It's broken open. It looks a little sketchy. We found it on the floor. She put it in the McDonald's yeah, bag because what does every girl do before they're about to take pictures in their swimming suit? They stop at McDonald's. A 20 piece nugget. 20! Woo! I didn't even know they made them that big. I 20 guess piece they do. nugget, large fry, diet cokes, all around. All around. We're just walking up to the beach. We are ready to do this. It's gonna be a lot of fun. It's gonna be lots of fun. The assistant. Yeah, all this assistant, stuff right here. assistant is carrying everything. In fact, you know what? Here's my other bag. Okay, here, take here, that. Here, come on. Here, Awesome. This is so beautiful. If only she had a good photographer who has know, a right? really great assistant, by the way. She does. <laughs> this one. Cut! Perfect. So, you guys, we are the original coconut water. Coconut? Coconut from the ground. And then the water next to it. There you go. Yeah, there you go. Let's open this baby up. That's right. They didn't have Diet Dr. Pepper, so we Sorry. had to go with that one. Do not disturb me. <laughs> this was the one idea I had, and I thought that it was going to be a great idea. She just wants to cover my face. So oh, please great. say that you love this one. What does it say when she wants to cover my face? <laughs> You're three days without the kids. Don't you want... Oh, that's cute. Mom's gone wild. <laughs> <laughs> and they're going in the water. Mindy, are you just catching some rays up here? Oh, you know, just trying to be a model and stuff. <laughs> Do you have come be my coconut? prop lady? A coconut. Do you need some seashells? Oh, oh no, that We're wasn't a good for one. A big one. Waiting for big waves. Had a couple that worked for photos, but now we want to get another one. I'm just not looking down because if I see a crab, I'm gonna freak out and probably cut my feet. These rocks are not. Okay, we got okay, one. Okay, we got come. one. Here we go. I'm ro I'm rolling. I'm rolling. It's coming in the distance. Do you guys see it? It's right coming, there. It's coming. It's coming. Okay, Mindy, ready? Pose. Here we go. 
wasn't a good one. That was a fail. We are in Florida. They don't really have big waves here. We did awesome doing the photos. We did the black suit. I changed into a white suit. It's actually a very hard task to do at a beach with no bathroom, but we did it. It's like this has been awesome. Yeah. Shelly oh, is getting the greatest I feel like it's been shots. a win. And Mana Jo has the greatest ideas. Yep. I She's know, like, I'm you have a hair out of place. She does have a good idea. She's really doing a great job. We're having a ton of fun. <laughs> yeah, we really are. Michelle won't stop talking about, about the these red, red umbrellas. Awnings. Oh, awnings. Umbrellas. Um, umbrellas. 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 Exactly red what umbrellas. it is. So we're yeah. going to walk a little further down the beach and get them. It's going to be your favorite Michelle, shot. Michelle, what is wrong with the saying. color here? Here they are. We're going to walk to them and it's going to be the most beautiful red awnings you've ever seen. Multiple outfit changes. We have gotten what we came here for. I feel like we had a huge success. I think we're gonna get in the car, pull the top off, drive back to the hotel, and maybe go hit the town, have a fun little dinner, and just enjoy. But you guys, Michelle has been crushing it, doing such an incredible job. And sweet Jolene, you guys, she is holding all of my bags, carrying everything, trying her hardest to help. It's been really sweet. They're just kind of the best. Wait, here, let me. All right, Shelly, let's open that top. Take the top off. Oh! It like transforms. Okay. Gotta hold it. Oh, okay. Wow, this video. <laughs> Here we go. There we go. <laughs> Should we try it again? You guys, this is so Welcome cool. Welcome to Miami. <laughs> hey, butter shoot is over. We are having treats. Heck yeah. Yes. Snacks, <laughs> treats. We're not going to eat the chicken so we don't get sick. We have been loving seeing mom partying it up in the sun in Miami. It looks gorgeous there, you guys. The beaches are beautiful. The water looks incredible. The weather looks actually pretty fantastic. And of course, mom and the ladies looking stunning as well. We here in Utah have our coats on. It's not quite as warm. We did have a little bit of sunshine today, but it's been one of the more bone chilling days. I cannot get warm. We're in the house. We've had the fireplace cranking all day. Sitting by the fireplace. Braxton actually was playing with a friend outside today, which I thought was pretty ambitious. They stayed warm with some gloves, beanies, things like that. Hazy and I have been in here by the fire. Crew is off at a friend's house. It is the weekend. It is a Friday. Picked up the kids today listening to the Friday, Saturday, Sunday what song? It's Friday. Jammed out in the car celebrating the kickoff of an epic weekend. Despite the freezing cold temps, you guys, despite the fact that I cannot seem to get my body to warm up to a normal temperature, we've decided that we want to finish off this awesome day, this epic it's night by getting ice cream. Ice cream. <laughs> so there's a fun little frozen yogurt shop nearby where you can get your own ice cream, mix in all the toppings that you want, have a lot of fun flavors. Sometimes they have cotton candy. I'm hoping they do. So we've thrown on our coats. We are bundling up and we're going to jump in the car. It's just the three of us. Like I said, cruise out of friend's house. Rye guy, I'll have to show you when we get back. We made a very valiant attempt. In fact, spent most of our afternoon trying to set up 24 hours in the metaverse in virtual reality challenge for Rye guy. I really just have to show you. I can't even really explain it. I'll show you all of the cables, wires, recording video cards, everything that we have downstairs. And we just have not been able to get it to work between complications with the Mac and the Chromecast and the Oculus casting, tried messing with the PC, blah, blah, blah. Who cares? Basically, we weren't able to pull it off, but he is still playing some virtual reality. We're going to leave him to that. We're going to head off, get some ice cream, and we will be right back. On top of having frozen yogurt and ice cream with all the toppings, these arcade games are free. You don't even have to put money in them. Just available to play. You can just go over there and play them and then eat your ice cream in between games. We made it back to our hotel. We're just gonna go walk around, find an amazing place to eat. We've got all dressed and changed, wearing some white pants. That feels very Miami. We're gonna go out and have a great night on the town, maybe do some shopping. There's a mall really close. Just to have fun. I have gotten so many messages on Instagram. If you're not following us there at this is how we bingham. You should be. So many messages from you. It's just so fun to see us girls just like laughing and having a great time. And you guys, that is one thing we are doing. We are having a fantastic time. It's been awesome. Now we're gonna go get the girls, take our cute outfits, and go have some dinner.
We are back home now. Kids loving that. I kind of forgot that they have those free arcade games. It's just a couple pinball machines and an old game. And the kids loved it though because you can just keep playing and if you die, you just start over again. No quarters necessary. One of the things that we love about that place is they actually also serve ice cream by the scoop. So you can get like scoops of ice cream in a waffle cone or in a cone or whatever. They have a ton of flavors of that, but we go straight for the Froyo. Got a ton of fun toppings. They actually had a bunch of freeze dried stuff, which I thought was pretty unique, including those rainbow sour belts. Freeze dried. Monterey's. That is next on my list. Those were amazing. Kids are upstairs. I think bathing. I just hear a lot of chaos. We're gonna get ready for bed. Not quite go to bed yet because it is the weekend. We got a little bit more time left on this Friday then. <laughs> Rye guy sent me that clip. We were dying. Speaking of Rye guy, just quickly. I know nobody cares, but it's been like half of my day, so I gotta show you this. Come here. This giant mess of cables and boxes, plugs, cords. My attempt throughout this afternoon to bring you a mixed reality experience in virtual reality. We've got this awesome Elgato HD 60S game capture device. We've got a little Chromecast action we were trying to cast into this and then record it on the computer. Computer. We've got HDMI's coming in and out of a splitter. We've got everything under the sun, you guys, and we did not get it to work. We could get audio, but without video. And then if we wanted to actually get Ryler in it with mixed reality capture, we had to use my PC, which my PC actually lives in the furnished room because <laughs> I don't use it for anything except virtual reality. And I can play that with an air link. I don't actually have to plug anything in, but we came back here and tried setting up the GoPro as a webcam to use as a recording device. If we wanted to do the mixed reality, like I said, the computer could do it, but they don't have something for Mac. Anyways, guys, this was half my day today, and it was a massive epic fail. And it wasn't just today. I've tried many, many times, but today was the day we were going to make it happen. And we didn't. But that's okay. We will keep trying. We will keep climbing. We will keep efforting. And we will probably someday make that happen. In the meantime, we'll just enjoy playing it, doing fun clips the normal way we've done in the past. But for now, guys, we are going to sign off from here at home. we got crew left still out. He'll be back soon. Just going to hang out with us tonight, wind this day down, and then tomorrow we've got some fun on tap. Mom's got another big epic day in Florida. As the temperatures drop, they're still going to be out there hitting the town, getting some photos. So we're excited to to see that. Love seeing everything they've been up to. Love watching their experience through the videos, through the vlog, the smiles, the laughs, the memories that are being made. It's just absolutely incredible. They're so glad she had the opportunity to do that. You guys, make sure you come back tomorrow for some fun, not just from here in Utah, but also in Florida. We love you guys. We'll see you then. Good night, everybody. We are back and we had such a delicious dinner. We went to Tacoology, amazing. We were at like the Brickle Center Mall. That's where we've been staying and it's so pretty. The mall's incredible. Today was an absolutely incredible day. Michelle crushed it on all the photos. We did great, we came back already, had a great night out. We ended up buying a few little things at the mall. Tomorrow, you guys, this is breaking news actually. We just got an email from the host of our house that the pool and everything will be back up and running tomorrow morning. We are so excited to check out the pool to check out the gym so many things that we've been waiting to try it's finally happening it's all working we get to try it out tomorrow make sure you come back because i think that's gonna be really awesome it's not gonna be warm it's gonna be awesome i love you thank you so much for hanging out with me and michelle and jolene from basically the mustang sally group love you so much and we'll see you all tomorrow bye Catching some rays up here. Oh, you know, trying to be a model and stuff. <laughs>